Hey guys, uh, this is Normal uh, here for Technique.com, and today we'll see some of the tips and tricks on our uh, Windows 8.1 version. So now Windows 8.1 is the latest build of Windows 8, and there are quite a few changes when compared to the initial release of Windows 8. So let's see some of the tips and tricks of uh, Windows 8.1. These are uh, uh, very simple tips uh, uh, like uh, this t uh, tips and tricks gets you uh, customized Windows 8 also gets you work done uh, more effectively. So let's uh, see some of the tips and tricks. So, th so this is a series of um, videos. So we'll start off with the uh, first set of uh, tips and tricks. So starting off. Um, one of the things uh, missing in Windows 8.1 is that the Q button to restart your Windows or shut down Windows. Generally, you need to go to the settings and then uh, have the power option and then uh, go uh, go to shut down or restart from here. But instead of that, uh, the be easiest way is to go to uh, home screen or you can just uh, press the uh, put the mouse around this corner and you can see the start button just right click the start button you can see the quick option shut down restart hibernate everything is available here apart from that you can also quickly access other uh, control panel options like programs and features power options even viewer and uh, quite a lot of them so this option is pretty simple just uh, hover the uh, your mouse uh, um, on the corners of um, your start screen and you can see the start button and just right click the start button and you can see the option uh, to shut down restart hibernate etc so that's uh, one pretty easy step to restart your pc now let's uh, go to the second option to customize the start screen so you have uh, these uh, start uh, button tiles on this uh, you can just drag and drop uh, them to rearrange it now if you want to group them into uh, several groups like say we have the metro apps desktop tools office 2013 etc just right click on the start screen and you can see the option customize so now click on customize and you can now group uh, into uh, different apps say let's suggest I want to uh, add these two into a new group so I just create a new group so I created two browsers in this group now let's uh, uh, name the group as browsers so there you go we have created a new group uh, browser uh, for uh, these browsers so this is a pretty easy way to customize your start screen so you can group apps based on your category like browsers uh, metro apps desktop tools or any other so this is pretty good uh, easy way to customize and reorganize your start screen now another good thing is that you can customize the start screen uh, using backgrounds and uh, themes so go to settings uh, from here you can go uh, again select the personalized menu so from here you can see quite a lot of themes available here uh, so these are the default themes you can select the themes and you can see the live preview of uh, the theme and then apart from that you can also customize the background color and also the accent color so you can select the colors and then uh, it will change accordingly so that's a uh, pretty quick it's live preview so you don't have to apply so it's uh, as and when you click on the um, option it will say uh, it will uh, change the color and then you can uh, customize the uh, start screen next up uh, we'll go to the pc settings so let's go to pc settings and uh, now let's go to pc and devices so here you can see the lock screen so lock screen has uh, uh, quite a lot of new changes like one is a uh, play a slide a slideshow on the lock screen so now when you select um, uh, switch on so it will you can select uh, pictures uh, which you want to show on the side screen uh, lock screen so you can select from pictures um, or you can select pictures from sky drive or from a folder or you can uh, manually add a folder so now um, now you can also include camera roll folders from pc and sky drive so yeah use these pictures that will fit best my screen and also pc inactive those those are a few options available so you can have a lock screen slideshow of your pictures uh, on the windows uh, 8.1 lock screen that's a pretty good uh, option to have on your desktop now coming on to the desktop uh, let's go to the desktop uh, and then uh, see some uh, options other options available so let's go to personalize um, so now let's go to desktop and see what are the options available so right click on the taskbar and you can select uh, properties so this properties has uh, quite few changes uh, you can see navigation uh, so here, here you can see one option start screen under the start screen when I sign in or close all the apps on the screen go to the desktop instead of start so whenever you log into Windows 8.1 if you select this option it will boot into desktop so this option is called uh, boot to desktop so instead of showing the start screen it will show the desktop instead so that's if you don't want to see the start screen all the time uh, you can go to boot uh, boot to desktop from this option 
now you, another option is uh, show show my desktop background and start so whenever you click this option uh, whatever be just uh, wallpaper on the start screen i mean desktop will be the same as that of uh, start screen so now let's uh, select apply so you can see here uh, the start screen uh, wallpaper has been changed now it is the same uh, wallpaper as that of uh, desktop so that's um, um, another option then uh, uh, you can also sh show start on the display that when I am using press logo you can uh, show start on the display as well so that those are the uh, few options available uh, here um, then um, apart from that we'll also see other options uh, that we'll cover in the next video so these are the first set of uh, tips and tricks on uh, Windows 8 so stay tuned for more updates if you have any queries on this uh, uh, drop a comment and we'll be glad to help you out thanks for watching the video and subscribe to our YouTube channel for all the latest videos on Windows 8.1 and if you like this video press the like button in the uh, bottom thanks for watching the video